Okay, so it got cut off last time. I think I was trying to describe if you wanted an example of what opposite rays were, you, you could do like GF and GE would be opposite rays, GF and GE, because they start at the same point and then go in opposite directions. Uh, for this guy, they have GI and GF are coplanar. GI and GF, yep, they're both on this plane here, so that is true, that's good. Uh, here they have the intersection of EF and the plane JKH, this plane here, is the line HI, and you're right, that is false because where these, the plane and this line intersect, the only point that they have in common is actually point G. So they intersect at point G if you had to fix that. Uh, here they say that the intersection of EF, HI, and JG is the point G, and that's definitely true. They all meet at that point. So that's good, that's true. Uh, here they have the intersection of plane EGH, EGH, which is this plane here, and plane G, G, JGI, JGI, the other plane, is point G. That's not true. They have more than that. They do share G. G is a point that is in both of the planes. But if we wanted the best answer for where this plane and that plane intersect is this line, HI. So that's false. HI would describe all the points where that this plane and that plane have in common. Uh, intersection of plane EFI, EFI, that plane there, and JKG, JKG, the other plane, is HG. Yeah, I mean, this is basically what we were saying here just with uh, different words. They described the two, only two planes that they've shown, which is with different letters. And now I called this HI, but you could also call that line HG. You can name it with any two points. So this is very true here. Um, sketch the figure that's described. Two rays that do not intersect, so they must be parallel. So just draw two little parallel. Oopsie, that's supposed to be parallel. They're not supposed to touch. So yay, two rays that don't touch. Uh, three planes that intersect in one line. So it could start off with these two planes here, so do your best to draw those two planes there. I guess I'll try it. Draw little parallelograms to try to show the dimensions, and then draw another little parallelogram there just to show those two planes. And then I'm going to try to draw another one slicing through it at a diagonal. And yay, my geometry skills. Try to draw another plane that's slicing up at a diagonal. Oof, and they all are supposed to meet in one line, that same line HI. So if I were to flesh this one out a little bit more, trying to draw another plane. Oopsie. Sheesh. I should take an art class. Oh destroying this. Okay, so let's try to make this other plane go up and up and connect and connect. Wow, this is difficult. And there, there's another plane. Okay, art classes for me, but hopefully that makes a little bit of sense. <laughs> All right.